Okay, Evora. This is how we do the oxygen bottle. Very similar to the machine, just a little more complicated. We're going to connect the valve using that wrench to the bottle and then to mom. Really? Okay, here we go. You grab the bottle regulator and you'll see that in, 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 inside there are alignment pins. See those two little alignment pins right there? And those are going to line up with the side of the bottle right there. So we're going to slide this over the top of the bottle until we get those alignment pins aligned just like that. And then we're going to tighten it up. I'm going to hand this to mom. Okay. Here, you hold that for me. Just point it right here. Tighten it up. Like that. See there? Okay. So you can see. Can you see my hands? Yeah. I'm tightening it up. Oh, they're just holding on this one. Yeah, just, this is your left hand you show. Just finger, just, just finger tight. Okay. Right there, just finger tight. Okay. So, now it's tight, it's connected, it's indicating zero. And what I'm going to do is open up the bottle. You open it one turn. All you do is one turn. Here we go, one turn. Do this here. Okay, can you show the wrench? Show the wrench. Can you see it? Right One here. turn. So here we go. Ready? One turn. There we go. You're holding it down below. There it's on here. And when I did that, the little gauge came up, and it's no longer on red, so she's got oxygen. So now we have air, and we're going to set this on two, just like the other machine. One, two. This is a different machine. And then we plug it in right here, and we connect it to mom. And you can hear that she is now breathing oxygen. That was easy, right? For you. Okay. <laughs>